hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we're back with a unboxing. Now this unboxing comes to us from the lovely folks over at Diamond Art Club. Now, this was one of the new releases and I don't know which one is in the box. I'm hoping it's the JoJo's Arts one, but I did order uh, another one as well. So we'll have to check it and see. So I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful day. Um, yeah, so I ordered two and I, I, I actually ordered them on separate orders because I wasn't sure if I wanted the other one. And then I was like, you know what? You only live once. YOLO. So I went ahead and ordered the other one as well. So I ended up placing two separate orders, but that's okay. Um, the other one to get here whenever it gets here. So we're going to go ahead and open this up, pull it out. It is a round. <gasps> Ooh, okay. So this one is actually Moon Elf. This is the other one I was debating because I was like, do I really want it? Yeah, I really want it. So I went ahead and got it. So she's a 46 by 69 round with ABs. Yeah. Let's take a look at her and see what she has to offer us. Let's see what she has to offer. We're going to go put, put this away because, you know, safety first. So we're going to take the plastic off. So you guys doing good? What you working on? Looks good. Looks good. You're doing a good job. Way to go. All right. So let's get this out of here. Possibly without breaking a nail. Bloop. Bloop. Oh no! My sticker came a little crumble, but that's okay. We're just gonna <laughs> we're gonna fix it. We're gonna we're gonna frantically fix it. Now you guys already know what I do to this sticker, so we're gonna take that sticker off there. Anyways, we're gonna put it on the side of the box here, uh, hopefully straight, so that when I go ahead and put this away. I know exactly what kit it is. So we got that. We have our toolkit. If you've never seen a Diamond Art Club toolkit, you will get a, a blue pen, blue squishy, two plates of heart-shaped wax, a um, couple of multi-placers, and some baggies. Y'all don't care about that. Let's go ahead and get into this kit, though. What's in this kit? What does kit do? So let's go ahead and get into this, which it's not a horribly big size. And just remember, if you're working on a kit that's bigger, section off your kit. You don't have to have the whole kit showing. Sometimes that overwhelms people to have the entire kit just out there like that. So go ahead and section it off. Use parchment paper squares or release papers to section it off so that it doesn't look so much as a daunting task. Um, that's what I like to do when I'm doing bigger kits. I don't mind bigger kits, but sometimes it can be overwhelming. So sectioning off will help you not being so overwhelmed with kits that are a little bit larger. We have that blue piece of paper that we're saving for Becky for her Christmas presents. Um, we also have our schematic here. Yes! Look at that beautiful elf! She's so gorgeous! Oh, look, she has little bubbles all around her and flower petals and a little butterfly on her finger. Y'all, I love fairies. I'm just saying. Look at her little headdress she got on. Yes. Y'all, y'all can really do some, some stuff with this. So we're going to see what they've done with it. But we have 43 colors. Good God. And it is a little bit of a darker painting. And you guys already know how Miss Coffee does with darker paintings. But I, I pushed myself and I finished my last one. So I'm pretty excited about that. <gasps> wow. Now, you guys already know Miss Coffee's a little weary about faces. I keep saying that. That, but yet y'all keep seeing pictures with faces. I'm just saying. Um, I think I'm getting a little better at it. You, you live and learn, folks. You live and learn. You, you, I'm just saying. Like they get better with the faces, and Miss Coffee keeps having to buy the ones with the faces. So roll it out. Bam! Look at the gorgeousness of this kit. And I said gorgeousness. That is a new word. I don't care what you say. Fight me for it. So, <laughs> so here we have it. Y'all, the charting on this is amazing. And again, it's not super big. And it looks like a lot of color blocking. All one color. All one color. All one color. One color. One color in here. It looks like a highlight there. We got some flower. Oh, sorry. You got, you got to bend down a little bit. See what I'm... You got some flowers down here at the bottom. I love how light the middle is and dark around it. It makes the center image pop, which is the fairy, which is what you want to draw your eyes to. I love the color of her hair because you guys know Miss Color Miss Coffee's gone through her color hair phase. So I love the color of her hair. Love the detail. You can see the butterfly. You can see her face perfectly. This was charted amazingly. They're doing such an amazing job at charting faces, and I'm here for it, hunty. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and get into the drills and take a look at those and see what they got for us. So, you know, if you're one of those people that doesn't like the noise of the crinkling plastic, please mute your phone for like mm, 30 seconds or until you see me stop struggling. So how was your day? You doing good? Yeah. So let's go ahead and take a look at this, shall we? So we have <clears throat> 210, 939. 310, 797, 208, 
820. Bloop. Double trouble on the 820. 823, double trouble. 796, 209. That was like Laffy Taffy. Double trouble. 211, double trouble. 519, 996, 798, 3837, 3808, 3325. Push that off to the side there. We got a couple of strings over here. I'm just saying, it looks like they broke apart. 3607, 3860, 3755, 917, 3021, 3021, sorry. 327, 700, 775, 3843, 762, 550, 3841, 3330, I'm sorry, 33, 334, Eh, eh. A B alert. Yes. So our first A B of this kit is 141. Look at the sparkle on those diamonds. And you are seeing this in natural light. So this is what the actual iridescent coating on those drills looks like. But if you're new to diamond painting or diamond art club in general and you don't know what an A B stands for, A B stands for Aurora Borealis. It is an iridescent coating that goes onto the drills to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter. It will also reflect the light of the drills laying next to it to make them sparkle brighter as well because if one shines, we all shine you heard so that is what an ab drill is if you are curious as to what an ab drill is and you're, you're, you're new to diamond painting so uh we will figure out where exactly that goes on this beautiful kit here in a few minutes we're going to take a look at the rest of these drills so we have one ab so far 38 10 333 then we have a long ranger of 3809 then we have 915 602 739 3064 701, 963, 603. And then our last three colors, eh, eh, AB alert. <gasps> Ooh, we got a pink AB, 124. 124 is the second AB I see in this kit. And again, if you want to know what AB is, stop skipping around. Go back to the first AB I found. So 124 is our second AB. And again, look at that sparkle. And how can you tell an AB from a regular diamond? One, the iridescent coating kind of gives it away. So whereas this one reflects and you see like a rainbow effect on it, when this one reflects, you see just white. You just see the diamond itself. So this is just the this this is just the diamond drills, as Brad Mondo would say, living their extra life. Yes. So we have the A B drill here and then a regular drill here. Um, we will figure out where that goes here in a few minutes. So we have 3608 and 703 and those are our colors so we're gonna go ahead and put those back in the kit there we go let's go ahead and get that out of the way so we have 124 and 141 as our ab so a pink and a white ab um we're gonna take a look to see where those white abs are i need one of those like finger pointers for this i'm gonna order me a finger pointer <laughs> um so we have abs here in her shoulder we also have some abs let's see here on this Nope, that's not an AB. AB up here on the butterfly on her finger and on her finger itself, right above her her lip here on her nose. We have one in each eye. We have one up here on the headdress that she has on her forehead here. We have some ABs right here. Um, these are all number twos that I'm pointing out right now. So we have uh, number two on this canvas is going to be the 141, so the white AB. We have some white highlights here in her hair. We also have some here on the flowers in her hair and on uh, whatever this is coming down from her hair. Another AB stash right here on this butterfly. We also have, oh, I'm sorry, you couldn't see. So here, here, in the middle of these flowers, on her headdress, um, in her eyes. I don't think there's any around her, but we have some on and on and above her lip on her nose there on this butterfly here um on her shoulder here coming down we also have some on this butterfly here right here on the bust of her costume here and then we also have some here on the behind her from like these bubbles or whatever this is we also have some more number twos over here now let's look for the other symbol which is going to be number one on this kit so i'm going to look for number one so it looks like we have some number ones here. Here on this butterfly, uh, we have some on this flower over here. Let's see, do we have any more number ones up here? Um, we have the number ones look like a lavender color. So if you look here on the butterfly, you see the number ones on the butterfly, they're a lavenderish color. I was thinking there was gonna be some on her, 
but I'm not seeing any number ones on her in particular. So let's see here. So I'm seeing it on accents of like the butterflies and the flowers, because then here's some more number ones on this butterfly as well. So they do have them nicely scattered about. They're not all bunched into one spot. So you guys know Miss Coffee likes them to be all over the place. So I, I, I commend them on this one. That That is a good amount of ABs and they are scattered. So I would give them that. Um, so that is it for me, folks. Those drills look really good. The canvas itself looks good. It's Diamond Art Club, so we know they got clear drill or a clear drill field. If you do happen to have a problem with any company, including Diamond Art Club, please feel free to contact them to let them know what your issue is. Make sure you provide those receipts. Yeah, I mean, so make sure you take pictures if you have any issues. Send it into them, and I'm pretty sure they'll be happy to fix it for you. But with that said. This again is Moon Elf. She is a 46 by 69 round with two ABs, which is 141 and 124, number one and number two on the kit. Drills look really good. Got your schematic with your uh, papers that are already pre-cut for you, making kitting up that much easier because Diamond Art Club's like, you got to get these done because guess what? We got new releases coming out. So with that said, folks, that's it for me. I absolutely love this image and I hope you do as well. If you were lucky enough to catch this, I think at this current point in time that you're going to see this video, it might be sold out. So make sure you put your email address in to be notified when it does come back into stock. But with that said, folks, I got to get out of here. Thank you so much for watching. Questions, comments, concerns, you know what you do. Put them down in the comment section. I'll get to them as soon as I possibly can. If you're new to the channel and would like to see more random crazy videos just like this, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I'm randomly decided to put up a video. And believe me, it's random. But with that said, folks, I must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you, it's a hard out here in these crafty streets, folks. So please remember to stay safe, wear your mask, wash your hands, don't touch your face, keep your six feet, and always try. Be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys!